I don't want you telling anyone else, right? Okay. When I was 12, my dad, he, um, he abused me, um, sexually. Mum found out and he beat her up. He said that if she told anyone that he'd kill her, so the first chance we got, we ran away. We couldn't stay with mum's family or friends because he came after us there, so we went to Jimmy. Mum and him had gone out before she met dad, but the dad never knew about Jimmy. We were going to move on to England, but my mum got sick again. She had cancer before and she, she got better, but this time she. Uh, I'm sorry. Car. I'm sorry. No, don't be sorry. You, you can talk to professionals about this. No, is, I yeah. don't want to tell anyone else. I just want to tell you. Kevin? Brandon? Look, I'm sorry about that. I wanted to speak to you in private before you left. It's okay. We're in private now. Well, look, your taxi should be here soon, but after what you said to me, I, I just wanted to make sure that you'd be okay. It's not an easy thing to deal with for anyone. Um, but take this. It's 24 hours if you need to talk to someone. What about your number? Can I get it if I need it for next time? Um, well, the police will have that, so if you want to book me again, you can do that through them. I like that. I want to say thanks. If it wasn't for you, I'd still be in there. Don't want you to think I'm some kind of monster. Look, I'm not here to judge anyone, Brandon. I'm, I'm just trying to do my job. I don't want to rape anyone. I want to be raped. See you around, Kevin. Yeah, see you around, Brandon. Good luck with everything. Have you been acting on these thoughts, Kevin? Tell me. Look, I don't really want to talk about it. I just want to know what I can do to fix it. I've tried everything, like, I've tried praying, I've tried taking testosterone, I've tried dating women. Like, I'll do anything at this stage. Man was designed by God and his image to procreate, to honour and provide for his wife. By living more like Christ, you will be able to overcome these feelings. But I... Freud suggests that sexuality is changeable and that the root of these problems usually stems from childhood deprivation. How was your relationship with your parents? Fine. Uh, normal, I mean... We would have been spanked if we did something wrong, but nothing out of the usual. Were you interfered with as a child, Kevin? No, no, nothing like that. This curiosity you have with the male form needs to be addressed. If you truly want to change, Can I suggest an, an experiment, a form of exposure therapy? Okay. I believe that if you were less curious about the male body, you would be less fixated on same-sex attractions. 
I suggest we both undress in order that you can feel more familiar. It, it has helped many of my clients. Pastor, I, I don't think that's going to help. 